scuba diving update. I am unfortunately not going to go scuba diving this summer because I'm already going to two camps and it's just a lot. So maybe next year I'll go, but I talked to my doctor and she said she hasn't really had anybody with cerebral palsy go scuba diving, so she didn't really give me an answer, but she said if I, like, don't go down too deep, I should be fine because of the water pressure with, like, the shunt and stuff, but it kind of made me nervous that she didn't really give me an answer, so I think I'm gonna put that on hold until next year, but that's something on my bucket list I would like to try. Um, I heard that scuba, di scuba diving is good water therapy for people with cerebral palsy, so I am definitely gonna check that out next summer and um, see how everything goes. I think I'm pretty sure what I've heard from my friends is we start out in a pool down by IUPUI and then we like train and get certified and then they email us like certain trips that we can go on but we have to do I think there's like computer training that you have to fill out and stuff too too so I think I might try that next summer we'll, we'll see I'm a little iffy on that but it's something that I want to try and, and again um, if I did go to scuba diving I would go through dive heart because they have worked with shunt patients before so that is my update on the scuba diving front and I will see you in my next video. Alright guys, thanks. Bye.